this is Sonia from my happy space welcome back at my channel today I'm going to do a Ella Ritz entry and I'm continuing with her theme the key verses in the Bible and I'm going to do some faith text cards today so I'm going to use a few printables this is the first one which is obviously we are justified by faith and it's Romans 3 verse 21 to 26 so I'm going to use this printable with this printable comes this beautiful gingham paper I love it then the next one is the Genesis 3.15, the redemption, the promise of the redemption. And this um the first time when Jesus was sort of prophesied the fact that he was going to come. So I'm going to use that beautiful sort of, I think it is, I think it is a free inch by, by free inch card. So I'm going to use that and then this pattern paper comes with it. And then she's uh, it's got a whole bundle of gingham pattern paper and the previous part of the month she had grit pat pat pattern paper, but it's still available in a shop. So I'm going to use this cute gingham patterns, which I love. I love gingham um, for the faith text cards. And then I've printed off her labels also. As you can see, all the colors coordinate. She so tries to keep the colors the same each month, so you can just... Um, Get some loads of her printables and you can just use it all together and these printables is all these grit labels and um, labels is always very handy to have in your stash so yeah what i'm going to do it as i said i'm going to do some five text cards i'm going to put you on fast forward and then we're going to put this together the first thing i'm doing is just making the five text card i've got a video of how i make my five text cards um so i'll link it up here and all the details all about five text cards so if you want to check that out but this is more or less basically what i do but i give you lots of other ideas also what to incorporate in five text cards so um I, as i said i love this gingham pattern it is so jolly as i would say um yeah it's, it's just such a basic a nice basic to have in your stats for any bible journaling or even memory keeping so i'm just decided to make a pocket inside as you can see i'm using my glue just to put glue on either side and at the bottom so just to glue it on so i can put a sort of a little journaling card in there i'm going to use some of these three by three squares to make as a journaling card so i'm just playing with my color scheme see what i can put underneath i love this bold genesis 3 15. it's an interesting way of um putting the address of the card down in the normal way so i definitely wanted to incorporate that and then there's obviously a tab with all the printables and um there is a reverse reference also but i couldn't find it i cut it out and it was so small it got lost so i decide i'm going to cut that card out and i can put redemption on my tab there so i love the color scheme of the other side the yellow with the blues it's not often um, a color scheme that you think it's going to work together but it does work so yeah and the verse we're looking at is chapter uh, genesis 3 verse 15 and it is so amazing that so early in the bible we already get the first glimpse of jesus now often sometimes people forget they think jesus was an afterthought god saw that this whole world is going to down in pits and then he had to think of an idea of coming to um, to the earth in a human form as jesus to save us but this is not the case um before the foundation of the world our names were already written on his heart so already he knew he's going to redeem him and jesus was never after thought he was there from the beginning so when we messed up and it didn't took us very long to mess up although we don't know how long adam and eve was in the garden before they sinned but if it wasn't adam and eve it could have been anyone it probably could have been us we can, we can't put ourselves above them i'm sure we would have failed also eventually and but god always knew we needed a savior and it's so beautiful that already in genesis 3 verse 15 he sent give us this message or the promise to eve um it says i will put enmity between you and the woman he's talking to the serpent and between your offspring he shall bruise your head and you shall bruise his heel. This is already a prophecy that the devil um, will, might bruise Jesus' heel, but Jesus will crush or bruise his head. With other words, kill him. He might think he's got victory on the cross when he sees Jesus on the cross and think, I've got him. 
um, no more redemption for mankind, but it was just temporary. And we know three days later, Jesus rose and there was victory over death. And that gives me hope and it should give all of us hope that there is redemption. And it's so beautiful that we're now going to look at the next journey card, which gives us that wonderful promise of that, yeah, this and security of our salvation through justification. So I've put a little um, clippy in there just for a little texture. I like to do that. And then I'm just playing a lot around with this grid labels. Um, just filling in all the empty spaces where it feels to me that something else can come there. Um, there was just an opening space, like an empty space for me on the blue card on the right hand side. But later you'll see I'm also going to use a label also to fill that in. In the meantime, I'm just going back um, to the other card as I'm thinking what I'm going to do on that card. And I've just put in redemption is, redemption is coming on the, on the red card. And then I decided to cut that octagon in half and sort of put it at either sides just to fill in some of the blank spaces. So I'm moving on to my next journey card and as I said that is all about Romans 3 verse 21 to 26 and it's all about justification. So I looked up what justification means. It says the act where God moves a person from the state of injustice to the state of grace or justification. I thought that was beautiful. God moves us. We are sinners in need of redemption. And it says in verse 23, For all have sinned and fall short of the glory of God and are justified by his grace as a gift through the redemption that is in Jesus Christ. And that is a beautiful, it's a summary of what we says now. We all have sinned. We all fall short. We all need redemption. And we get it for the justification by grace as a gift through Jesus Christ. A beautiful summary of the gospel. If you ever doubt what the gospel is, just read Rome. Romans is anyway such a fantastic book. It's absolutely a, a must read for any Christian, a must study. Um, you can probably study for the rest of your life Romans. Yeah, so I recommend you to go and read for Romans if you haven't, or if you haven't done it lately, it's a beautiful book. So I use the same principles uh, principle um, for these faith text cards also. I've just put the, the square cards next to each other rather than on top of each other because I wanted to bring all these elements out, the words on it. It was important that both of them um, are shown to me. And then I've also just popped the journaling cards inside and used some of these grid labels um, as little tabbies to pull them out. And I've decided to put the whole Romans passage there. So the first bit is in the back of that journaling card and the rest is in the back. So here is my journaling cards. I love how it turns out. They are so bright and beautiful. And it's a good reminder. And I think it would be good for us to go through all those 16 verses which um, Alice suggested and align it in our Bibles. So I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please give it a like. And if you haven't subscribed to my channel, please do so. And I will leave all the details down below, all the printables, if you're interested to pick them up from Ella. Um, yeah, I'm looking forward to what she has for next month. Her printables is always very, very beautiful. I love working with them. Yeah, you must have a fantastic weekend. Um, lots of love and thank you very much for watching. I appreciate it. Bye-bye.